How's it going, everybody? Uh, what's up, Robiteers? As I, I have started saying, I guess. I am, against my better judgment, jumping into Fallout 76. Now, Fallout 76, I, I'm not even really a huge Fallout fan. I'm a big fan of the old isometric view Fallouts, the classic Fallout games, but was never a big fan of the Bethesda Fallouts. Um, and I'm even less excited about ma multiplayer online games because people are dicks and this is just another playground for people to be dicks that said it's a new game I gotta check it out I gotta see what's up um, I will probably be unhappy just to let you know I'm <laughs> but I guess that's probably part of the fun of this is this is not going to go well. Um, so today is actually the 13th. Bethesda played a little whoopsie uh, and released Fallout 76 early for all PC gamers, but not console gamers. So, yay. The good people of America. So that if the bombs do come... I have played a little bit. But I'm going to create a new character for this. Will endure, but not a very special saved. topless robot character. Those chosen to enter this vault must be our best and our brightest. For when the fighting has stopped and the fallout has settled, a voice sounds familiar. Must rebuild. Not just walls, not just buildings, but hearts and minds, and ultimately, America itself. So as we stand here today, we pray that the world will know peace. But if that is not our destiny, if war must come, we stand together knowing that here in Vault 76, our future begins. Inspiring. Isn't this supposed to be the first vault that opened? I can't remember. I know that there was something special about Vault 76. I'm pretty sure it's supposed to be the first vault. This is the Overseer. Good morning, Overseer. I hope you all enjoyed the party last night. Even those who may have overindulged and overslept. Wow, oh, hello. Uh, so let's get out there. mess with this a little bit. Oh, I guess there are a bunch of presets. Oh, let's get weird. Why not? Um, but I'll never forget the day you all entered Vault 76. You come from every walk of life, every make that pretty long. Can rotate. Oh, I see. Let's do one of these. Oh, and scale. Scale, definitely. But more importantly, you'll all. That's. What is that altering? Oh, there we go. There we go. Yes. Dick nose. Uh, how weird can we get here? Let's accept that. Uh, scale that forehead way up. Yeah, let's go way up on the forehead. And we can kind of scrunch it, it looks like. Slide. What does slide mean? Whoa, weird. What does that look like? Yeah, yeah, there we go. Let's just make you pretty weird and pronounced, shall we? Scale, let's make those big. As a big bottom lip, let's give you an infinipout. Kind of leave you a little open there. Slide that out. Just everything exaggerated. Everything exaggerated. Up and out. What's weird is he's not looking weird enough yet. Rotate. 
Ah, corners of the mouth. Yeah, let's go with kind of a grimace. A constant grimace. Slot. Whoa. Let's make it tiny. So he's always doing Magnum. Or Blue Steel. Oh, let's make some big ears. We need some big ears. Uh, scale. Oh, is that just lobes? That is just lobes. That's impressive. How about top? Can we mess with that at all? Doesn't really seem like it. Oh, we can slide. Okay, there we go. Yeah. Let's really fuck his shit up. Uh, slide. Can I move that? Uh, oh, 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 oh. Let's make him droopy dog. Oh, I, I can't do a droopy impression. I'm not even going to attempt to try a, a droopy impression. Uh, all right. Let's select that. How weird can we make these eyes? Whoa. They just came outward a bit. That was a little scary. Let's make them look like... Uh... Oh, God damn it! What was the villain's name in... Aeon Flux. Something Rothschild. Get that weird Aeon Flux vibe. Yeah, there we go. Now, I just realized I am just making an Aeon Flux character. Let's make him as gaunt as possible. Get those razor sharp cheekbones. Yeah, he is totally an Aeon Flux character right now. All we need to do is change that hair color to something like gray. Silver. Something... Nah. Let's go with bleached. Yeah, this right here is an Aeon Flux character. Absolutely. You know what? I'm actually pretty good with that. Let's, let's call that done. Uh Oh, body. Uh let's go with very thin. Like not muscular, not large, just very thin. And yes, we have an Aeon Flux character right there. Perfect. Or a Duckman character. Looks like he he could belong in Duckman. All right, we're done. Just calling him Topless Robot, because it's easy. Snap shot. And done. Cool. So now we wake up and use the lamp. I have to go get my pit boy. Can ring the alarm clock, apparently. Hmm. <laughs> Excuse me. Pet boy. And smooth jazz. All right. Just tab to open your pit boy. Look at that. It got a boy that's a pip. And out. Whoa, that's interesting. The last character that I made started up there. Alright. Well, let's just go, shall we? We get some water and some radix. And then some stim pack and some radaway. Actually, you know what? I think. I might be talking in game. I am talking in game. People can hear me in game. Let's fix that, shall we? Because I will look like a crazy person. Let's go to menu. Settings, audio, voice chat mode, auto. 
None, team, area, auto. Let's just go with none. I'm kind of disappointed that there isn't a push to talk option. It's just you're, it's either on or not. Uh, back out of there. All right, am I talking? I'm not talking. All right. Let's do this. Grab some building supplies. Fine, uh, I'll follow. I'll follow, Vault Boy. And a party hat. Yay! And our camp. Limit one per person. Thank you, Crowley. Whoa. Easy peasy. And glasses. And perk cards. So we get to pick a perk. Um, I kind of think I want to go endurance because running away seems like a good idea. You take 30% less radiation from eating or drinking. Uh, yeah, I'll take that. That's fine. So I have not Oh, I didn't equip those last. Interesting. So you can only have one in each slot at any given point in time, but you can collect the perk cards. Okay. Share. You need at least three points of charisma for each perk point of the card to be sh I don't know what that means. You can share with the group, maybe? Share the effects of a perk? would be interesting. And out we go into the wild blue yonder. Alderton. Let's go. Oh yeah. Well, that's a handsome looking man. Kind of looks like the dude who takes Ferris Bueller's car on a joyride. Yep. Just older. And we have discovered the forest and all kinds of things. We can start ransacking nonsense. Let's go back to first person because that's way easier for me. There we go. Nothing there. There's a dude over here, and I can get a gun. So that'll be good. Equip that. 12 bullets. Okay. Oh, there's some things to kill. Ow! Hey! Whoa! Hey! Rude. Why? Why? What? Now he's running away. Where? There we go. All right. Now that I'm completely out of ammunition, because I'm an idiot. All right. There's that. Rebuilding the future for a broken nation. Some steel scrap. Metal pile. Metal pile. Wasn't there another dude? Thought there was another dude. Where'd the other dude go? Other dude. Other dude, other dude. I don't see the other dude. Oh, is he up top? May have been up top. I don't think I can get to him. Oh, well. I have one bullet left. And I have to track down the overseer. So it's definitely a very pretty game. I mean, just look out there. In the mountains of West Virginia. Oh, well, hello, Pennington. 
Embassy's terminal. Gave a little listen. Seems you should meet her at her camp just down the road. Of course, since we've already been told that there are no NPCs in this game. Spoiler, we're never going to find the Overseer, I'm sure. Paul, I need you to make the monthly scouting run to Vault 76. Those doors have to open sometime. Don't take risks. Observe for a few days and come back. Maria. Machete and pre-war money. It'll be good to have uh, a um, melee weapon. I reckon. Oh. Well, there goes my one remaining bullet. And now I have to switch to my machete. Bring it, you fuck! Ow, what the hell was that? Hey, I won. Where's the other one? Isn't there another one? Yeah, there he is. Left alt to power attack. Ooh. Cool. There's that. Aluminum scrap. I need bullets. See me creeping along with my machete. Oh. See, this view makes it look significantly more sinister than this view. Where he's just kind of like, oh, I'm stalking. So, la, 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 tra, la, la. I hear something. It's a beaver. Oh, he's running away. Hey, I can get beaver teeth. What's up here? A banjo. And a mouth harp. You can sit and play the mouth harp. This truly is West Virginia. Alright, I'm going to let him play us out. That's going to do it for this first episode of Fallout 76. I'm going to be playing a whole lot more of this, I guess. Kind of. And, uh, so... If you enjoyed this, let me know in the comments below. Thank you so much for watching. I'll see you in the next one.